Are you guys ready to play another episode of Dad and Kids Play Minecraft? Yeah! yeah. Alright. Quiet on the set. Quiet on the set. Here we go. Hello everybody, this is Purdue Matt, and welcome to another episode of Dad and Kids Play Minecraft. Uh, whoa, I just hopped into the uh, horse pen by accident without realizing what I was doing. Can I get out of here? Yes! Alright. This is really hard. It's, this is kind of like driving while looking in the rearview mirror. Um, <laughs> so, uh, welcome to Season 2, Episode 2 of Dad and Kids Play Minecraft. We are here at the Season 2... Uh, version of our world uh, and as you can see we have found an extremes hills biome that we originally thought would be our home but guess what we have done a little bit of exploring and we have found a place that might be even cooler to make a season two home if you believe that if this is cool what we have to show you is even better so you guys have a treat in store for you. Let me go back to first person mode, bring up my stuff bar, and, well, that's a neat trick. How long did it take you to train your horse to do that, Diamond Gal? Uh, two seconds. <laughs> two seconds, all right. <laughs> I just All right, pressing. so we've, I think we've sufficiently em emptied our inventory. I'm gonna gear up. As a matter of fact, I'm gonna get my armor on and hop back on my horse. Where's, oh, wait. Bad horse. Did my horse go all the way over there on, on yeah, his own? Yeah, it's a fast horse. So this, uh, I've, I've named this horse Orion because he has stars on his flank. I and so our, our, this, the place that we found is actually off in this direction right here. So you guys with me? Yeah. All right, so we'll leave the horses here. We'll come back for them later. We'll, we'll bring them over to the new, uh, to our uh, season two home here soon. There are also some horses there. All right, so we are on our way, and I think we, mostly we just have to follow the coast and come around this direction. And we found another supply of horses, but I think we're pretty doing pretty good for horses now. Uh, there's a place right here we can ford the river without having to get off our horses, which is always handy. You guys still with me? Down. Okay. All right. Yeah. All right. So you. Oop. Let's wait on Geo guy. There he is. All right. So we've got to head out this way. We mostly just have to follow the coastline. And as you can <coughs> see there, we found some new horses. horses. So so horses will not be lacking in this world, unlike they were at Outpost Alpha. Well, it's not a different world. And it's across this plane, it's biome. Well, Dad, you know, it's not a different world. Well, of course it's not a different world, but as we said in our previous episodes, um, Outpost Alpha was rendered in Minecraft 1.4 point something. So many horses. Ah, la, la. I think, yeah, I still need to get my bearings. I think it's around this way. Yeah. So here it is, guys. I can't see it. My red is six. <laughs> Now, come on up. Isn't that awesome? Oh, yeah. Oh, and we got some nice, beautiful tulips. Yep. Dibs. So we've got a perfect ocean view, which is awesome because we always like to have bases that have access to the water. And that is deep ocean biome out there. So it's my hope that we will find somewhere close by. Ooh, I found the perfect spot. An ocean monument, perhaps, somewhere out there. And so we're going to, ah, I didn't mean to jump into the ocean with my horse. So let's go around. So what I'm envisioning is something up there for our base home. Hi! Dad, look and, up. Look oh. up. Hi! <laughs> Hi, Geo guy. <laughs> and then jump 
Oh, darn it. Almost made it with my horse. Come on. You can do it. You can do it. You can do it. You can do it. All right. So this... Ooh. Is your horse okay? Yeah. This might make... If we hollow this out, this might make a good stable in here. Dad, follow me. I found, like, the epic spot. An epic you, spot. Found, you found the epic spot. Okay, let's go around here. Okay, okay we're going to have to leave our horses here, though. Because right. it's deep water. Deep water. Okay. It's so, like... So leave our horses right here? But... Do you have a fence? I think I might have a fence post in my inventory. Ah! Throw my sword around. Uh, I do have fence posts. So let's just tie up our horses here temporarily. Time to go. I'm and coming. I'm exploring. Okay. Which is exactly what Diamond Gal likes to do, and that is completely okay. So, so let's put. I have place, I have a torch. This place you can only get to it via. via I have the, 64 uh, torches. Okay. So you want to tie up you want to tie up your your horse diamond gal? Yep. So okay, this do, place. Do you have a? Uh, I have a ten. Oh, you have ten last or uh, <laughs> leads. Okay. All right, let's go. You can only get to it via river or if you climb half the mountain. So. We gotta jump in the water. <laughs> Cannonball. So. Uh, wait, no. This oh. would actually would make kind of a neat uh, docking area. Oh, hold on. Where we could put. Uh, I think I saw a different place though. We could we could dig down and this could be kind of a dock and there'd be some <laughs> stairs going up to our base right here. Oh, this is a nice Dad, it's a nice water valley here. Yeah, this is uh How about a whoa whoa ravine? Oh a ravine oh, right built here. Built in ravine. Sweet Secret oh. dog. <laughs> Careful, don't fall in. It's not that deep. Don't kill me. He said ah! Said, 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 Dad. I'm trying to get on this piece of gravel right here, so I. Ooh. Okay. So yeah, awesome ravine. I didn't even see this when we when we first found this. So we've got a built-in ravine here. Do we need to have this water? It's really annoying. So the the, uh, yes, actually, that's that's our way up and down oh, into yeah. the ravine. Yeah. Ooh, how about this place? To we'll get rid of this lava. Ooh. Well, the lava has its uses. For, let's leave the lava for now. How about we get it in buckets? Oh, but don't kill yourself. Okay. Minecraft Steve can go in lava and then come up perfectly fine. Yeah. Just, just brush it. Just brush it off. Brush it off. Okay. Maybe. We'll see. I'm not sure where the house will go. But it'll go on one of these peaks. And then we can connect the peaks with uh, uh, wooden bridges. Like rope, rope bridges of some kind. I think it should be clean stone bridges because I think. Okay, now I'm the one on fire, so maybe we should rethink that lava there, because <laughs> every all three of us has stepped in it. No, nothing. Oh, I thought I heard you catch on fire too. Actually, I might. <laughs> so the kids have had an idea that we should open up the naming of our new outpost to our studio audience. Yeah, because we've argued a bit too much on what the name should be. We all yes, have we've had, opinions. Yeah, we've had uh, Outpost Gamma, which uh, it's, it's, it keeps with the theme, but it's a little uninspired. My idea was uh, the Emerald Outpost, and Catherine's idea, uh, Time and Yell's idea was uh, like the Fluffy Bunnies or something. No! <laughs> what was your idea? I Diamond. don't remember. What was your idea, Diamond Gal? I don't remember. Well, anyway. Um, so... Please, uh, audience, put your uh, ideas for a base name here uh, in the comments section. Uh, we will, in a, in a, between now and the next episode, we will take a look and uh, pick, choose, choose one that we think is best suits this um, outpost. So we've got up here on the peak. So what we really need to we need to find decide which peak we're going to build our base on. Dad, uh, you were saying something about rope bridges. Have rope bridges going from that peak to that peak to this peak. Yeah. Or wooden bridges. Wooden so bridges. what really we need to decide is where our main building is going to be. Well, I know where the diving board's going to be. Woohoo! <laughs> right. This is a perfect. Uh, Swimming hole launching spot. Jump, 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 <laughs> jump, jump. Okay, jump. Be, be my luck to hit something on the way down. Uh, 
Yay! Diamond, you up! Come on! Oh, she, oh, she, oh, she's throwing snowballs at us. Diamond, you up! Are you coming? Fine! Oh, let's catch. I got it! Whee! <laughs> wow, she went all the way to the bottom. So, alright, well, it's nighttime. How about that, guys? And let's let's just quickly take a look at. Uh, so we've been recording for ten minutes, and so um, it's nighttime. I do not have any torches that I'm aware of. I have sixty-four. You have sixty-four. Uh, I see a patch of coal. So why don't we do this? Um, we need some place to be safe while we construct. We're not going to build a suitable base in ten minutes. So I suggest somewhere over here, away from the place where we're... Oh, there's a spider jockey. Spider jockey! Sorry. <laughs> I'm getting some coal for torches. Okay. And actually, did I see a second spider jockey over here? Oops. Sorry, sheep. Yeah, there's two spider jockeys. How often do you see that? Sorry, sheep. Well, spider jockeys are one in 100 chance, so two yeah. of them at the same time. I hate math. <laughs> yeah. Did you one in wow. one thousand? Or okay, and we have our first creeper crater. So I have officially christened our new base <laughs> with its first creeper crater. I'll have to fill that later because I don't have sufficient fill material. I purchased. Okay, so um, could could you could you light this area up over here? Well, where are you? I'm over here in the clearing. Thanks. That's much better than over here by the tree. <laughs> okay. Well, you know how you know that the the plains biome uh, ah, two we, that we rode rode in on. Yeah. Yeah. Over by the plains biome. I see some light. I see nameplates. Okay. Okay. Yep. Oh, I forget that your render distance is lower than mine. I'm, I I happen to be using the fastest computer, so I can use the uh, I can have our render distance up. It's a new Macintosh, so if you 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 perceived a in improvement in the quality of our recordings that's primarily the reason why is I'm no longer uh, working on an older computer <laughs> so let's make a qu quick cozy cottage out here shall we dad the tree is on fire a tree Oop, what tree over there oh that's I think that's somebody's arrow it's my flaming arrow <laughs> oh, okay so, so uh, Geo Guy, would you will you run um, uh, will you run screen for for Diamond Gal and me while we build, or Diamond Gal, you can take care of the baddies while uh, Geo Guy and okay. I build. What would you like to do? Well, then I'm gonna go build an. Uh, I'm gonna go. Do you have a crafting bench? Uh, I I do I do not. Uh, I'm gonna go get one. I'm gonna go kay. get a log and make one. Just take one of mine. Take Wait. one of mine. Wait. I have a bunch of them. Okay, so we're building a cozy cottage. Uh, do I have? I don't have any tools whatsoever. Here's a shovel. Uh, oh, I just now get benchmarking. Interesting. Okay, so let's clear out some of this dirt. So I'm going to trust you guys to uh, keep the baddies off of me. So should we make this a uh, bit of a time lapse building our cozy cottage? Sure. Okay, I'm going to get some wood. Okay. All right, so as soon as I finish clearing this out. Zimby! Zimby! I will. We will move over to time lapse, and hopefully, I'm not the only one building. <laughs> <laughs> well, the other, oh, okay, there's, a, there's our second uh, creeper crater. Now it's your turn, Diamond Gal. You need to make a creeper crater. No. All right. Here we go with our time lapse for our cozy cottage. Time lapse. Time lapse. Oh. Time lapse. Black. Black.
So, looks like we have our cozy cottage more or less done. We'll probably add a little, a few more flourishes here and there. But uh, I think we are off to a great start for our new Season 2 home. Yay! Please, 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 if you have some neat ideas for a name for our base, and keep in mind, this is a, this cozy cottage is just kind of a... Uh, uh, temporary main home. Uh, we'll probably keep it after we're done with it, but uh, you know, we won't destroy it. And maybe it'll be a guest house or something, or maybe a storage place for a farm or uh, something like that. Or we could turn it into stables. We could what? Turn it into stables. Or, or turn it into stables, but of course our stables are going to be up there where the horses are right now. Oh. But, so keep in mind our uh, our primary home is going to be eventually be up here in the mountain. And it's going to take us a few episodes to get there, I think. And it's going to be like uh, the bridges from the, the three peaks that I was telling you about. Yes, exactly. Uh, the uh, we're going to have what we envision as having a main house on one of these peaks. We haven't decided which one yet. Probably the biggest one. And then bridges connecting the different peaks so, and with with uh, buildings of some kind on each of those with different purposes. So the only thing we're lacking right now, we have a vision, we just don't have a name. So you, our audience, are going to help us with that. And the winner, tell you what, we will, it's possible to, um, using commands, you can get somebody's head, right? Yeah. Okay. So whoever we, whoever's idea for a name uh, for our base that we pick, we will immortalize your characters, your Minecraft head, somewhere in our base. So just um, maybe we'll just put it on a spike as a warning to creepers and zombies. <laughs> <laughs> now we're gonna do something more more respectful than that. But, <laughs> of course, <laughs> I'm just uh, joking. So yeah, send in your um, uh, idea for a name and your Minecraft Woo! username. I, I think the Enderman there had something to say about that. I know. So, yes. But make sure you send in your Minecraft username or we won't know who to give it to. Exactly. So when you when you leave us the, your name uh, and you leave your comment with your suggestion, uh, also leave your Minecraft name so that when we choose the winner, uh, we can, we can uh, uh, command in your head and place it on a spike somewhere close by. I'm just kidding. We'll do something with it. Don't know what yet. But anyway, I'm rambling. So, I hope you enjoyed this episode. I hope to see you again soon. And in the meantime, what do we always say, guys? I like it, turtles. I like turtles. No. <laughs> no, Minecraft doesn't even have turtles. Enjoy no, your own adventures. Enjoy your own adventures. And enjoy ours. Wake with up. us. And until, and until next, next time. time Ciao. Hey guys, and welcome to the comment of the day segment. Uh, very excited to be bringing you our second. Uh, in installment and our second uh, viewer who has earned his uh, character's head on an, a, a armor stand here and we are back in the uh, cathedral throne room and we're going to add the uh, second member of the executive of the week guard or the king's guard here and this week's uh, chosen uh, comment question of the day it comes from Call of Duty Miner 360 uh, whose Minecraft name is AZ Chilo 99 and uh, where is Diamond Gal by the way I don't know where Diamond Gal oh my goodness ah uh. ouch ow ow <laughs> Anyway, Ow. Call of Duty Miner 360 or AZ Chilo 99 says, Oh my gosh, I saw the comment, lol. Anyway, question. How does GeoGuy get so smart in Redstone? And I'm in the 8th grade and can't make really cool Redstone things like Geo. So, GeoGuy, how do you do it? 
uh, practice, trial and error, and I learned most of the things that I most of the things that I use in my uh, builds are I learned from just watching videos from people like Seth Bling or I get like ideas for certain circuits and then put those to use. Um, but just keep trial and error and just keep going at just keep going at it until something works. Well, there you go. So that's how it works for me. Direct most, most of the, my builds, if I don't know how to build it, I just keep trying to build what I think would work, and it takes about an hour, but eventually I make it work. Excellent. Direct from the mouth of our local redstone expert. As you can see, we got the correct head for Brody Jack. Thanks, Brody, for getting back to us with your Minecraft name. So, without further ado, let's bring in AZ Chilo 99. Da -da -da -da. There he is! He's got a funky looking Minecraft head. It looks kind of like a Cyclops or a camera guy. So, hint, hint, hint. hint, hint. Um, we may be uh, introducing a new character in our series soon, just to let you know. But uh, anyway, so let's end the segment and uh, we're going to leave you with our comment question of the day. And our comment question of the day is What's your favorite biome and why? So leave your comment, answer to our question in the comment section below. And uh, don't forget to subscribe if you like our series, like our channel. Uh, give us a thumbs up if you like this video. And uh, if you haven't already, subscribe to our channel because we would love to have you as a regular viewer. Talk to you later. Ciao. Ciao.